Yes, 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 yes. What's going on, guys? Day Trading Addict here. And today, I have a great video for you guys. I'm going to show you three ways to trade breakouts, trading a US 30 like a boss. So let's get to it. Now, shout out to all of my addicts out there, all of my new addicts that's coming on to my videos. Guys, I know I'm not the only one that's addicted to these markets. So let's get it, guys. Now, if you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button because over here, I help struggling traders and I help advanced traders get to that next level because I know it's, you know, sometimes it's hard to get to that next level um, because, you know, trading itself, um, especially if you don't understand it, it can look like, you know, uh, you know, another language that is so hard to understand. So um, I've been doing this for 13 years. I've been trading the US 30, NAS 100, S&P 500 for like 12 years. So I know a lot about these markets. And today we're going to talk about how to take breakouts because I know for a fact a lot of new traders love to take breakouts. So what I'm going to do today is show you guys, you know, the breakouts that I like to take and um, you guys can build a, you know, a system um, based on that. So um, let's talk about two main reasons why breakouts fell um, before we even get into breakouts. So let's talk about that. One reason why a lot of breakouts fail, especially if you're a newbie, and you're trying breakouts, is because you're trying to to take a breakout when the market is ranging. Okay, so let's say that you you see the market about to break this low right here, you go short right here, and then you know you get stopped out because overall, if you look at the market, guys, it's just basically ranging, right? It's ranging. It's not doing anything. So you have to understand that if the market is ranging. And you're trying to take this breakout right here okay um most likely that breakout will fail okay now another reason why a lot of uh newbies get trapped or you know don't know what they're doing when it comes to breakouts is a lot of times you have to understand if the market is tr you know has been trending for a long time you know a breakout might not work okay so let's say that you bought you as soon as it, it broke this low right here okay and you got trapped so you have to understand man you know the market been trending for a long time should i break, buy this breakout or should i you know use a different strategy okay so keep that in mind now let's look at the first way to buy breakouts okay now the first way to buy breakouts is in the tr uh well actually when the market is ranging okay now if you're if you're looking at the market is ranging the best way to buy a breakout guys is wait for the market to either go to the top of the range or the bottom of the range and wait for a consolidation pattern okay this one we have a nice little flag pattern right here okay and you can trade the breakout out out of the range okay and a lot of times the market will if it's strong give you another breakout okay if we, we look at this right here it gave us another breakout so you had an opportunity to take the first breakout right here and let's take a second breakout right here okay so that's how i play play breakouts when the market is ranging i want the breakout to be either at the top or the bottom of the range and um and i take the breakout from there okay let's show you guys another example Okay, here's another example. Now I want to show you guys where it, it didn't really uh, really work, right? And the reason why I want to show you guys is because you know you have to be prepared if it doesn't work right away. So let's show you guys real quick. So let me zoom in real quick, okay? And notice how we have this nice. We we are at the bottom of the range, right? So the market is ranging back and forth. We at the bottom. Now notice how we have this real quick. Let me show you real quick. You have this uh, nice little breakout right here okay now notice how it broke out okay and it came right back in now if it came right back in me personally I would just put my stop to break even and I would get out okay um, because it hit the bottom of this but it shot right back in that's a strong possibility that the market will come back and stop you out so you just put your stop to break even no problem and you know and just look for another opportunity now we do see another opportunity notice how we at the the top of the range now this this range right quick let me show you this big range that we are in now we're in the top of this range we at the top of this range so let me draw this real quick okay this breakout okay so 
we have this breakout right here okay um at the top of the range okay and um nice consolidation nice little triangle break and from there you got your profits so that's how i trade breakouts when the market is ranging it has to you know i need to see some type of consolidation at the bottom or the top of the range and that's how i will play that okay so that's the first way to play breakouts um in the in when the market is ranging now let's look at another strategy to play breakouts now another way to play breakouts um trading the us 30 um uh, is using trend lines and waiting for the market to react to the trend line so let's show you guys real quick we have a nice little trend line right here notice how the market hit this trend line and is reacting to it right so we are going to um look at price action while it's around this trend line okay and while you notice okay price action and you notice that price action is consolidating right here okay giving you a nice little consolidation right here for a nice breakout okay i love these two i love these when it comes to the trend line it consolidates and give you that nice breakout okay um let me show you guys another example real quick and this one was um actually not too long ago um and we have a trend line right here let me zoom in notice how we have a nice consolidation going on here okay nice little triangle breakout give us a nice little breakout and basically went you know crazy okay nice 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 reward on that one uh, depending on um you know your risk tolerance uh, definitely definitely could have got a nice little two to one from here okay so um I, I love these consolidation breaks especially when it hits the trend line and start consolidating I, I love this one so guys let's go to the next one and this is the last one now this one guys you're looking for a reversal so it, you can actually look for a you know break of structure or you look for a trend line break this one if you notice how it, it you know the market was going up right and you could tell that the market was getting weak because look how long it was just going nowhere for a long time okay and then let me zoom in real quick guys and show you okay um what i'm looking for when it comes to this breakout okay so um now notice how the market was going nowhere and we had this situation here right here this nice consolidation right here okay and we finally oh let me draw this better okay all right so we broke it right here but it wasn't it wasn't enough okay it came back in and we broke it again okay now notice how we broke it the second time we had this nice consolidation okay i would love to take this breakout right here because a lot of times when you catch the top of a move or a bottom of a move guys you can get a lot of uh money because you remember it's a new trend okay so these new trends can actually produce a lot of uh profits for you okay um so you know this is something that you you need to work on especially if you're new understanding you know reversals uh but this right here alone guys i mean um if you was in this trade you can look for a nice two to one three to one okay um easily okay easily look for a two to one three to one um especially if the market is going uh down because when the market is going down it, it goes faster when it's going down uh versus when it's going up okay uh you know the sellers do not play when it comes to selling the market it goes faster when the market goes down okay so this one i mean the reward on this one is just absolutely ridiculous but um let me show you guys uh, um another another example okay um now oh actually let's go back to this because if you notice a lot of times it would give you let me erase this real quick it would give you another entry okay so it gave you another second entry so don't me personally i wouldn't be scared to uh, take that second entry because remember this is a, 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 a you know a start of a new trend i love these because 
you know, it has a lot of power behind it, okay? Um, so I would definitely take this second one, okay? Even the second one gave you a nice two to one, three to one. I mean, it's, you know, like I said before, especially when you're dealing with the sellers, um, you, you can definitely, definitely, um, you know, look for a nice, nice winner um, from, from these uh, breakouts right here, okay? Um, so let's go to the next example real quick. And this one is a trend line break, okay? Nice little trend line break. We are trying to catch the early move, the start of a new move, okay? So let me zoom in, do we see anything? Okay, so we have a nice little break of the trend line. I do see this real quick. Notice how we have this holding up. Now, if you zoom in a little bit more, okay, let me zoom in a little bit more. Okay, this is where I would take my, notice how we have this consolidation right here. So this is where I would take my break out right here, okay? Um, so as soon as it broke out of here, nice little pop, okay? Now I came back to this area again, okay? Because we have a lot of, a lot of demand right here. I came back to this area, bouncing off this area. Do we see consolidation? Yes, we do. I do see consolidation right here, and I would take this break too, okay? Definitely see consolidation right here, okay? Nice breakout for a nice, you know, nice up move. So. Keep in mind that these early trends, right? When the market decides to reverse, these early trends will give you, uh, you know, a lot of profits because you know it's it's early, like you're getting in early, so it's starting a new trend. So you have to understand a lot of times uh, this will, you know, just give you a nice two to one, three to one. And when I say two to one, three to one, if you're new to that, uh, you know, that, that language, basically I, I mean whatever you're risking times two or times three. Okay, so if you're risking one hundred dollars. You know, times that by two or times that by three. Okay, you can definitely get that um, with these moves. And another thing you have to understand that a lot of times when you get these big, you know, these uh, actually these breakouts, um, it will give you a second breakout. Okay, so notice this gave you a, a tiny second breakout. You know, it's tiny, it's very tiny. But you know, if you understand how uh, the read the markets, you can de definitely tell that this is a breakout right here. Okay, so a lot of times. Um, you have to understand that these breakouts will give you a second entry, okay? So keep that in mind, guys. Keep that in mind. So this is the end of this video, guys. If you definitely got some value out of this video, guys, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. I wanted to show you guys how to trade breakouts like a boss. So let's get it. Hit that subscribe button. What I'm trying to do is um, do, you know, a new video every maybe Tuesday or Wednesday. So, uh, you know, stay tuned. Talk to you guys later, and please, have a great day.